KVE Plasma 6.5, next-gen features for Linux users. Tired of a desktop that feels stuck in the past? KDE Plasma 6.5 arrives as more than a polish bump. It's a focused refresh that tightens performance, polishes the visuals, and improves how Plasma works with Wayland and modern hardware. Let's dive into what makes 6.5 worth your attention. What this release means. Plasma 6.5 isn't a ground-up rewrite. It's an inflection release. The KDE team focused on finishing features introduced earlier in the Qt6 slash Plasma 6 transition and on smoothing the rough edges. Expect reliability improvements, small but impactful UX changes, and a number of user-requested quality-of-life features. What's new? Quick highlights. Polish and visuals. Rounded window corners, automatic light-dark theme switching with optional wallpaper switching, and refined animations that make the desktop feel more modern. Clipboard and search improvements. Pinned clipboard items and smarter fuzzy searching in KRunner to find apps and calculations faster. Better Wayland and KWIN behavior. Smoother window activation, improved fractional scaling on mixed DPI setups, and fewer input gesture hiccups. Major improvements for multi-monitor and laptop users. Polish in core apps. Tighter integration between terminal and editor. Console Kate activation. Discover Flatpak improvements and more granular settings in system settings. Aesthetic revolution, look and feel. Plasma 6.5 nudges the desktop toward a more consistent, modern look without forcing change. Rounded corners and improved theme switching give an instant, refreshed feel and you can opt in or out if you prefer a traditional look. These small visual investments matter. Consistent animations and theme transitions reduce visual noise and make workflows feel faster. Performance and Wayland. Plasma 6.5 continues the push to make Wayland the default for everyday desktop use. The release brings tighter frame timing in KWIN, improved fractional scaling and mixed DPI handling, plus fixes to window activation and input handling that reduce visual glitches and improve responsiveness. Important for both desktop users and gamers. There are also power management tweaks that target longer battery life on laptops. Productivity and connectivity. Real-world gains. Small workflow improvements add up. Pin important items in the clipboard. Use better search in KRunner. And enjoy tighter app interactions. For example, launching a file from console can raise the right Kate window. Discover's Flatpak handling and integrations with cloud or mobile tools are more reliable, so app installs and device pairing become smoother. Compatibility, stability, and the road ahead. KDE shipped Plasma 6.5 in October 2025 and followed it quickly with a bug fix update, 6.5.1, to smooth remaining regressions and translations. If you're cautious, Wait for your distro's stable packages. If you're adventurous, live images or distro snapshots let you try it today. Who should upgrade? Everyday users who want a snappier, prettier desktop will appreciate the polish. Laptop users benefit from power management improvements. Multi-monitor and mixed DPI setups will see the most practical Wayland gains. If you rely on very old GPU drivers, test first. Some edge regressions were quickly patched after release. Closing. KDE Plasma 6.5 isn't just cosmetics. It's a focused step toward a more polished, modern Linux desktop. Try a live image, test the workflow changes that matter to you, and tell us which feature made the biggest difference. If you want, I'll show a hands-on install and a checklist for testing your hardware next. Thanks for watching, and I will see you in tomorrow's video. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe for daily videos. Bye.